Hello everyone and welcome back to Final Fantasy Tactics Advance. This is a special episode. Since I don't know if going there will end the, uh, the series, we'll first go to the pub. I've been saying I've, I will be reading the the rumors once and why not just before the ending. <laughs> so here we go. The first one is law. Wait, laws. Colon history. How laws came to be. Laws have been a part of life in Ivalice for hundreds of years. The king in those days used powerful magic to create the first laws. The king then established a judicial system to enforce his laws. Knowledge of the means to control the laws have been has been passed down to the royal line ever since. Uh, unfair laws. Laws are unfair. Resentment towards the Queen Remedy has been building these past uh, the last these the last few years. The reason? Frequent and seemingly arbitrary changes in the laws. It's gone so far that some pundits really say she's doing it to please the, that bread, the prince. Well, those are the ones we already read once, so to the next one, the crystals. What are the crystals? Bavinia's uh, palace, selling on the matter up until now, has radically uh, reversed its policies concerning the crystals. According to information just released, crystals exist in special folds in space, called themes. The report on, goes on to state that, as the crystal's magic is beneficial to all Ivalice, special means are being employed to protect them. And the strong laws. Laws get tougher. By the order of Queen Remedy, laws are getting tougher once again. Protest, mo mo uh, protest movements have already started in some clans. The reason given for this latest strengthening is of the laws is to maintain public order. This is likely a reaction to the recent surge in clan warring. Secret Chops Easel Secret Shop The famed Easel Berbier has apparently opened a secret shop in the town of Caduan. The new shop reportedly caters to law card traders. The Yagd. Yagd is a bit of roof. The law is absolute in Ivalice, but there are some areas it cannot reach. The Yagd. Lawless slums where no judge will ever go. While this may sound appealing to some, even hardened Class A criminals avoid the Yags, for without judges and laws, there is nothing to prevent true death. Tr trade goods. Trading boom. One man trade merchant using small airships to do their business are on the rise. Many of the merchants sell rare items and the number of shops selling trade goods is growing daily. We only got one trade of out of it. I think it really is you have to do multiplayer stuff to get those. Which is a shame really. Uh, wanted poster. Wanted. Bervenia's palace has put up a ba uh, fat bounty on someone's head, but who? All the palace says can well. All the palace can say is the fugitive is a human member of some clan. Well, that is uh, almost everyone, or oh, a lot of people in in this uh, world. Judges alone. Judges go independent. Yesterday, Judge Master Sid announced that the judicial system would hereafter operate independently of the palace. This establishes the judicial system as a truly neutral entity, free from palace politics. The decision was made with the Queen's approval. Was it? Well, I guess it m must have been. Royal vacation. Queen on vacation. Her Majesty Queen Remedy, along with Prince Mute, have decided to take a break from the heretic... Oh, rather, not heretic, but the hectic and administrations of Ivelisse and go on vacation. There has been no announcements of where they are headed, nor any indications yet of when they will return. Clan Borzoi I hear Clan Borzoi is on the war path these days, challenging, challenging other clans, fighting for turf. Ah, things for just aren't the way they used to be. Dirty secret. Borzoi's dirty secret. Word on the street that Clan Borzoi's got the backing of a foreign criminal ring. Maybe one with eyes on Ivelisse itself. Thief exposed. The thief they caught was identified as a member of Clan Borzoi. I, uh, I dare say they won't be sitting around quietly with one on the, of their own in prison. Bervenia uh, Tourney is back. The Bervenia Tourney is scheduled to be handled again this year in the palace courtyard, and everyone's excited to see the best, the best in the land compete. In the land compete. 
The tourneys, sword and sorcery, swordsmen and sorcerers alike are competing in monthly tourneys across Ivalice. There's even a few tourney pros who live off their winnings. Clan League, best clan in the land. The Clan League will be running again this uh, year. While the favorites are last year's winner, the Brown Rabbits, they will have a lot of competition. About the Clan League, a Clan League is a, a tiered competition to, de to, to determine the best clan in the land. Winners are chosen by popular vote and engagement standings. League committee chair Sid expect. Wait, Sid. Okay then. Expect a good turnout this year. The winner last year were the Brown Rabbits, led by the Viera Vili. Okay then. Ruins found. Ruins found in Nage. Ancient ruins have been discovered deep within Nagi Cave. Clan Tempest claims credit for the find. The entrance to the ruins appears to be a statue found within the cave. Perhaps other such statues can be found elsewhere. Elsewhere. Abilities. Abilities. If you want to win where you engage, master some abilities. Your weapons and armor determine which abilities you can use. To choose carefully. You will also need some ability points, AP, to learn abilities. You can get those by equipping armor and weapons or by clearing missions. Everybody who goes on a mission has a chance of getting AP, so be sure to take along your friends, that's all, good luck to you. Ability types, action abilities, standard actions like black magic or monk tech, reactionary abilities, dodging or striking back when attacked, and support abilities, enhancement, enhancement abilities such as double sword, immediately giving one of the best, <laughs> and combo abilities, abilities to trigger when an ally uses a combo. And job change, a job change, a job changing can come in handy. Any soldier can cast spells by changing jobs to mage. Choose the right job to maximize your engagement potential. One thing though, your race determines what jobs you can be. Only Vayaris can become quick-footed fencers and banger are tailor-made warriors. So make lots of friends. Expert jobs. The better you are at one job, the more job options that become available. available. Expert jobs give access to powerful abilities like double sword and jump. Morphing. Morphing. Been to the monster bank yet? Did you know that morphers can use their morph abilities to borrow the abilities of any monster in the bank? For example, you can borrow a bomb's abilities to deal fire damage to your enemies. Use capture to put the monsters into the bank and then equip the soul they drop to gain their morph abilities. Yep, monsters can sometimes be your best friend. We didn't really use that a lot. Oh, at all, really. Conditions. Win or lose conditions. Though engaging was all about defeating you, uh, thought engaging was all about defeating your enemy. Think again. There are many kinds of win conditions depending on the, on the engage engagement. You can check the win condition during an engagement by selecting mission for the main command menu. But there are, but there's a lose condition as well. So be careful. If March leaves an engagement, whether he's sent to prison or even zombified, and then s snuffed, you lose. Combo. Ever notice the judge gives you judge points when you defeat an enemy? You can use these points to cooperate, uh, cooperate on, combo on combo attacks. Stack up those judge points and do some real damage. Just make sure your allies have combo abilities so they can pitch in. Wait, so does that mean that the more ju judge points you have, the more damage you will do with combo? If yes, then holy crap, that's gonna be a lot. Exemption. Prison exemption. You know there's people out there that n that never get a red card when, they're in they when they engage. There's a special law that turns all their red cards yellow. You can tell one by the ribbon they wear. The lucky buns. Oh, it's the boss ribbon, yeah. Those bastards. We had that in uh, very early on with the Ice Mage. That was really annoying. The Totema. The Totema. The Totema's appearance in Ivalice was sudden, and their o origin unknown. Unfathomable, unfathomable too is their incredible power. One thing we can say is they seem willing to lend that power to us. It is possible to summon the Totema using judge points obtained by defeating an enemy in, a, in an engagement. Only members of the race that the to Totema represents may summon that Totema. In other words, you would get further talking to a rock than trying to summon another race Totema. Okay then. Laws. Laws set by the palace reign in Ivalice. Judges enforce those laws and those who break them are pe penalized. Even sent to prison in the worst cases. 
There are two kinds of cards you can get for breaking a law. A minor infraction gets you a yellow card, a major infraction gets you, uh, will earn you a red card. Whichever penalty card you get, it will go down on your record. And the more cards on your record, the steeper your penalty becomes. So watch out! Yeah, we've had a lot of those. Many because of stupid decisions and um, misremembering what the laws were in. Uh, law rankings. The judges use a ranking system to classify laws. The stricter the law, the higher its rank. R1 laws are easy, but an R5 law is nothing but trouble. Imprisoned. One of your friends is in jail. That means they can't fight. And that's bad. But if you got the gill, you can get them out, and that's good. A release gets them out of prison, but their penalty records, uh, rec record stays. A pardon erases one person's pe uh, past record, but you have to go into prison in their place. And not really that you have to go, but they have to stay in prison a bit longer. But law cards. Thanks to Easel, there's these cards out on the market now that can change the laws. Select law cards after engaging to see what you have. If there's a particular card you want, try t trading with Easel. White cards add new laws, black cards or anti-law cards nullify laws, and the judges can't do a darn thing about it. This is a very good the anti-law. Negotiations. Engage or negotiate. Clan competition is fierce and engaging in the order of the day, but engaging is the order of the day, but try negotiating with the friendlier clans to avoid needless engagements. Treasure hunt. Sometimes treasure appears when you place a symbol on the world map. When you see a symbol shaking, that's where the treasure is, so go get it. Mission requests. You can advance your clan by accepting mission requests at the pub. You can use a guild and items you earn on missions to earn to equip your clan. Okay. Uh, mission items. Mission items. So you get yourself a mission item. That was a long time ago. You can't equip those. But you can bring them along on your missions. Missions item are good for boosting an ally's cap uh, capabilities and some mission requires certain items, so get as many as you can. Clan level. Take a look at your clan level to see how well your clan work is doing, is going. You also have a skill level that goes up when you compete and complete a mission. You need skill levels to take on new missions. And the higher your skill and clan levels go, the better your clan title gets. And that means more items and cheaper prizes. Wait, what the? Why am I all the way over here? Okay, where were we? Yeah, we were way down here. Uh, no. N yes, we were even more down. Okay, then. No, not the treasure. No, the treasure hunt we had. Mission items, clan level. Yeah, there you go. Skill level now. <laughs> Took a while. Uh, skill levels. There are eight kinds of uh, skill levels. Combat, magic, smithing, craft, appraise, and gather, uh, gather, negotiate, and track. Okay then. Uh, clan and their turf. The areas of a clan's influence its cards, its turf, and some clans think that means they can exploit whoever lives on land under that control. If you look at the map, you will see that only your turf is colored in. Take care if you're going to try to liberate any area under the control of another clan. If you see a free area go right, it means that another clan is trying to take it. If you don't engage them quick and drive them, drive them all off, it's all theirs. We are still missing a few and they have no idea how to get them. Linking. Attach a Game Boy uh, copyright. Advance to Game game Link copyright. Cable to link with others. You can fight together, trade items and even trade clan members. And trading goods. You can buy three uh, items just like regular items and some are great deals. The more you link, the more the items Nono can offer. Yeah, so link often. A ah, shame that we can't link. Uh, I think that was it then. Ah, 15 minutes. Ah, that's alright. So then everyone, I hope you enjoyed this uh, room of full... Yeah, room of full uh, episode. And I hope to see you next time. Mm, bye!